Un el que camión había... que había volcado. Había ah, un camión sí, volcado. Lo, 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 lo vi ahí en la noticia. Es que yo no sabía cómo es que toda la vida de que los pulquetes trabajaban y trabajaban y cómo descansarán o aquí cómo se tiran así en la calle de lado, y quedan dormidos. Hello people, good evening. Good evening. Hello good evening. teacher, good, good afternoon. Uh, good evening. Good evening guys. Everything is good, everything is all right. Good evening. Good evening. Good evening. Al igual que cuando estaba en la escuela, entre el prop y todos. <risa> No, ve que las buenas costumbres no se olvidan más. Eh, un masa desde ayer está así. No, pues está, que, es que, está, es que está profe, bien enérgico. A ver qué está no, tomando. No, no. Ah, Luis, Luis, extraña al, al profe Mauricio. Sí, eso es lo que le pasa. Y... No, solo que ya me hacían falta verlo, hombre. Ya estaba hablando en agua de regreso. En agua, <risa> Sí, como tengo cerca en Aguizalco. Es difícil. Nahua es difícil. Ya. Yeah. Yo creo que a ese no llegamos. La cara la tenemos, pero el idioma no es. Como dos el marco. Acaba la tienda. Okay, I think it's time. Very good. Let's get started. Okay, we're going to, we're going to take this first attendance of the evening. So please, cameras on and respond. Okay, say present loudly. Atilio uh, Ernesto Castillo. Present. Okay, very good. Consuelo Saraí Rivas. Good evening, teacher. Good evening, Consuelo. Eric Edenilson Escobar. Present here, teacher. Okay, Eric. Welcome. Thank you. Eric Jose Hernandez. Present. <laughs> Ahorita voy entrando. Just, just a time. Mire, mire el pat. Evelyn Guadalupe Gómez. Present. You, oh, you are Gómez Lemus, and my wife is Lemus Gómez. You, you may be relatives. Okay. <clears throat> um, 
Yes, check here. Hernan Antonio Chacón. Present teacher. Good evening. Good evening. Welcome. Good evening. Thank you. Jennifer Gabriela Arevalo. Present teacher. Okay, welcome, Jennifer. Okay. <clears throat> Jennifer ha de sentir algo, algo de oírlos a ustedes hablar de tanto pan dulce y café. No, no, no. Ay, me causamos estrés. Jennifer Lisset Aquino. Present. Ok. Welcome. Jose Abel Izaguirre. Jose Abel, not today again. Hmm. Jose Miguel Massa. Present. Hey, very good. Juan Antonio Elias. Present. Welcome. Luis Miguel Corvera. Present. Y junto están. Ok. <ríe> Luis, hay que poner el nombre completo al, al ingresar. Please. Por cuestiones de a la auditorías de Insafor. Marcos Vidal Umaña. Present. Thank you. Welcome. Nelson Orlando Tejada. Present. Very good. Welcome. Pedro Alexander Osorto. Present. Present. Okay. Welcome. René Alessandro Teresón. René Ale... No. Not again. Ruth Abigail Brito. Ruth. Not again. No, yesterday she was. Sofía Carolina Hernández. Okay. William Alexander Paniagua. Present. Good, welcome. Tuleima Rosibel Catalán. Present. Welcome. Jorge Luis Martínez. Not here. José Fernando Marroquín. Present teacher. Okay. Good. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay, perfect. Just let me see. Eric Edenilson. Eric Edenilson. Hello, teacher. Okay. Um, Ayer, pues, nos presentamos y tú eh, no estabas ayer. Me gustaría que te presentes, nos cuentes de dónde te conectas, dónde trabajas, um, algo acerca de ti, ¿verdad? Para conocerte un poco. Y eh, no sé si este es primer módulo, ¿ya estuviste tú en el módulo uno también? Sí, ya estuve en el número uno. Ah, ok. Entonces ya sabes que se nos pide la cámara encendida durante toda la sesión. Asimismo para los demás que tienen la cámara apagada. Sí, ¿verdad? sí, teacher. Solo que en esta computadora no, ahorita no, no tengo cámara. Ya el día de mañana sí ya. Ah, ok. Ya voy a estar ready. Ok, entonces cuéntame a mí, porque los demás ya te conocen. Yo no te conozco. Cuéntame. <ríe> pues soy de, de San Salvador. 
pues trabajo también en Global Pay Solution. Aquí esa empresa está ubicada aquí en San Benito. Trabajo como desarrollador IT. Eh, estoy encargado de la parte en frontend de las aplicaciones. Eh, más que todo es el diseño de, de la parte visual de las aplicaciones. Ese es mi trabajo. Ah. Sí. Nada más. Nada más. Sí, solamente y algunos reportes que me tocan ya. Ok. Ok, sí. Eric. Perfecto. Thank you. También veo por acá a Zuleima. Hola, Zuleima. Cuéntanos un poco de ti. Hello. Um, my name is Zuleima. I'm San Salvador. I am work in Radio Shack in Paseo Escalón. I'm mm -hmm. supervisor. Ah, okay. Very good. Nice to meet you, Suleyma. Welcome. Teacher. Yes. Eh, este, José Abelujo es otro compañero mío. Ya va a entrar. José. Abel Mendoza. Ah, okay, okay, okay. Ya va a entrar. Vaya. Bueno. Vamos cuando entre lo recibimos y le damos la bienvenida. Perfecto, gracias. ¿A ¿Quiénes son compañeros de Henry Alberto? Ok. Este, no sé, bueno, supongo que ya le avisaron que no es, no está inscrito en este grupo. Está en otro grupo. En verdad, yo espero que ya le hayan dicho. Aunque okay, yo lo reporté y pues me dijeron, sí, él está, él está en otro. Good evening, teacher. Good evening, José Abel. El, el día de ayer no pude estar presente, teacher, porque estaba sin energía eléctrica por la tormenta acá, cerca del área costera. Ah, ok. Sí, bueno. Así que, eh, ahí sí, ya estamos ready. Aprovechemos y cuéntanos de ti un poco. ¿Dónde trabajas? ¿A qué te dedicas? ¿Dónde estás? Bien. Eh, bueno, pues eh, mi nombre es José Belisay R. Mendoza. Eh, estoy trabajando y laborando en la empresa que se, se llama Global Pay Solution SADCB, publicada en San Salvador. Eh, actualmente vivo cerca de Acajutra, así que aquí estoy a las órdenes. Ok, eh. perfecto. Excelente. Ok, well, last class we were talking about this conversation and lesson one. Um, let me share the screen. So we read this conversation and um, we had a couple of questions pendant. Yeah, question one says, remember please and tell me, What activities do Mario and Sofia do on Mondays? Can you tell me, please? Anyone? What activities do Mario and Sofia do on Mondays? Mario check Emil, um, calls Clint. Ah. Client. Ah, Sofía, okay. I read a willing report and attend a meeting. I also have to organize meetings. Okay, okay, very good. So they check their email, call clients, read a weekly report, attend meetings, organize meetings. That, that is what they do on Mondays. And number two, do you consider that it is important to check your email every day? What do you think? What do you think? Um, let's see, Jennifer, Gabriela, it, it is important to check for you, for you and your work. Is, is it important to check your email every day? Yes, important because I need to know 
um, where what what told me my passion or how how do I not say dudas? Doubts, questions. Doubts, question, question for mm -hmm. uh, nutritional plants or for anything food. Yes, important to review my email all day. I need a nutritional plan. I'm gonna talk with you later. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Okay, good. <clears throat> okay, um, what about uh, who? Somebody else? Okay, uh, Eric, Eric Jose. Is it important for you in your work to check your email? Yes, yes, it's very important. Uh, I check and send the email every day. Ah, okay, mm -hmm. good, good. And you, William, is it important for you to check the, your email every day? Yes, it's very important because I need to uh, check uh, files and send. And send. Okay. Good. How many, just another question, just to think about it. how many emails do you usually receive people per day? How many emails do you, in an average, how many emails do you usually receive per day? Okay, write in the chat a number, write in the chat a number to see who receives more emails per day. Write a number in the chat. Maybe 20. Who, really, Tony? My goodness. Write in the chat, people, write in the chat. Okay. Hey, come on, write people. How many emails do you receive per day at work? Okay, so the record is Tony at the moment. Uh, Nelson, a lot also. William, well, is a big number for me. So. Uh, five or eight, that's that's normal. Five, yeah, that's fine. Consuelo, ten, no, is, is good. Marcos, wow, it's a big number too, 35. Uh-huh. Come on, people, right, don't be shy. 60 to 80. Jose Abel, a lot. Uh -huh. But Tony, see, Tony, 120 emails. And you read them all, Tony? <laughs> the 80% of all? Yes. Oh. Okay, 30, 3 to 6. Okay, a lot of, a lot of information, right? So in this time, we, there is a lot of information. Perfect, very good, very good. Okay, then um, 15, 10 to 20, okay, a lot of, more than, more than WhatsApp or Instagram or Facebook. Okay. Now, there is a chart here with some activities that people usually do at work on a regular Monday, they say, okay. On Mondays, I, well, check my email. 
type a letter, write a report, attend a meeting, call clients, read a report, visit clients, organize meetings. Mira, y al final que vamos a comer. Espérate, mi amor, ya vamos a llegar. Esperate un momento. Yeah. Pizza, you can order pizza. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Buena esa, profe. Buena esa, mi respeto. Yeah. Buena. <laughs> I'm sorry, Jennifer, but <laughs> it's fast food. It's junk como food. Goza, como goza. <laughs> okay, repeat, please, this vocabulary. Check my email. Check my email. Check my email. Type, Check my type, type a letter. Type a letter. 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 Yeah, be careful que no, que no suene como una T, que no suene como leather, porque leather es otra cosa. Leather es, es cuero de los zapatos, piel, ¿verdad? Leather, no, es letter, letter. Letter, letter, letter. 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 exacto. Letter. Como una R, como una R, letter, letter. Letter. Ajá. Ok, sí. Number three, write a report. Write a report. Okay, good. Attend a meeting. Attend a meeting. Attend a meeting. I call clients. Call clients. Six, read a report. Seven, visit clients. Eight, organize meetings. And please, in, in the chat, write two more activities or two other activities that are not here, okay? That are not here, that you probably, or that you usually or regularly do at work. I don't know, for example, in my case, what I usually do on Mondays, let me think. Okay, let's see. Uh, prepare lesson plans. Maybe that's me. That's me. Okay, prepare lesson plans or uh, egg students on works. That's me. What about you? Please, in the chat, write two other activities. Two, at least two. Two different activities you do, particularly on Mondays, because it's the beginning of the week. Well, I'll give you a couple of minutes. The rest can take notes because that is new vocabulary.
your classmates' activities could be new vocabulary for you. So you can take notes on that. Hi, Rene. Hi, Luis. Rene, ya no quiere estar oh, aquí. Él tendría que estar tres grados arriba. Who said drink coffee? Come on. Okay, well, a lot of things here. You can read them. Clean my area, support sales, upload files to server, update report, clean my desk, update report, serve customers in the store, Supervise the cleaning in the office, make taxes, write accounting report, check my emails, visit sales promos. Make you okay, yes, rooms. Rooms, ah. Visit sales rooms. Okay. Distribution of merchandise, check the orders. Drink my coffee. Come on. <laughs> Take an inventory. Design final artwork for printing. Design applications. Superv supervise, maybe, como un verbo. Sales routes. Check work orders, prepare payments to suppliers for the week, sell different products, attend cases the clients, create and update the projects. Okay, interesting things. New activities. You can take notes if you want. So there are some interesting things. Mm -hmm. Okay, good. Now, the next activity here is to complete the sentences with one activity from the box. Okay. From these eight activities, you have to complete the sentences using these activities. For example, I call clients every day. I use the company's phone. This is call client. Call clients is taken, call clients. 
Okay. Number two, I'll give you a couple of minutes to complete the activities, the sentences using these activities here. You might uh, Let's do something. Okay, I'm going to give control of 
of the of the mouse or the keyboard to one of you. I'm going to give you the control. So I want you to write the answer for sentence number two. So let me start with Jose Miguel. Okay, Jose Miguel, I'm giving you the control. Now you can write in my screen. Yes. Okay, uh, give me a second. I need, okay, now, right. Okay, Jose Miguel, complete the sentence. So, para escribirla, porque no, ah, okay, ahí está. Mm -hmm. No me daba chance. No sé si me equivoco, estaba bien, esa le había puesto. Okay. Sí, well, la, la, the activity is, is good, but I think you need to adapt the form. Because the sentence says, our secretary write oh. writes a okay. report then send them via email. So, la oración da la idea de que los envía. So, entonces escribe más de uno. Si tú pones eso, debe ser en plural. Write, Rep write reports. Reports. Ay. Ok. Y si, y si es plural, ya no hay que llevar a. Porque A is one. Quita la A. Ajá. Okay. Así. Yes. Our secretary writes reports. Then she sends them via email. A ver, there is, there is still something missing. Yes. S, where? Rights. Rights. Okay, right. No, no, I'm sorry. Rights. ES. Here. Rights. Okay. Our secretary writes reports. Then she sends them via email. Okay. Very good. Thank you, Jose. Now, I'll give control to... To Atilio. Atilio, I will give you the control. You have the control now. Oh, okay. There. I, twice a day, I use my laptop computer. What, what could it be? Yep. Okay. Okay. Now complete the sentence. Uh-huh. 
ไอ้ไโอเค very good okay yes perfect thank you I check my email twice a day I use my laptop computer. Perfect. Uh, now number four, Evelyn. I have two every Monday at eight o'clock. Hi, no Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I I forgot to give you the control. Now, now you have the control. I know. Okay. Perfect. Thank you. Let it go, let it go. Let it go, let me. Let it go, Evelyn. Don't move it, don't move it. <laughs> don't move it. <laughs> let me take back the control. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Perfect. I have to attend a meeting every Monday at eight o'clock. Perfect. Okay. <laughs> Why? What did I do? Okay, let's continue now with uh, Nelson Orlando, number five. Let me give you the control. Nelson, Nelson. Okay, now you have the control. Yes. Organizer meeting. Mm, okay. Okay, perfect. Thank you. Celia organize meetings. The meetings take place in the auditorium. Wow. And six is about you. Is something about you. Okay. Uh, for example, me. I prepare lesson plans for my week class. Okay, that's me. What about you? I will um, write one sentence about you in the chat, please. Write one sentence about you in the chat. Similar to these ones. I have an observation. And uh, number five. And the oh, okay. Places. Oh, you're right. I didn't realize it. 
Thank you. Organizes because it's Celia. Okay, write one sentence about you, please, in the chat. I take a meeting every day at eight o'clock. Okay, you could say I take, or maybe it's better I have. Okay. But write your sentence in the chat, please, so everyone can see it. Old sales, I'm busy client. Uh -huh. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six. I only have six sentences in the chat. Okay. Hey, I need to go to San Miguel on Saturday. Give me a ride. Seven. Write your sentence on the chat, please. I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven only. It's a sentence about your activity, one of your activities at work. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay, very good. Let's do something. First, uh, let's practice these sentences. And after that, I will put you in groups. So, and I want you to talk about the activities you do at work. So, the sentences you were writing. Okay, I want you to to talk about that in your groups, okay? Let's practice these ones. Repeat, please. I call clients every day. I use the company's phone. I call clients every day. I use the company's phone. I use the company's phone. Our secretary writes reports. Then our secretary writes reports. Then she sends them via email. Then she sends them via email. Then she sends them via email. 
I check my email twice a day. I use my I, laptop I, computer. I, I check, I my, check email. my emails a day. A day. I, I use my, day. Use my, day. my laptop computer. I have to attend a meeting every Monday at 8 o'clock. I have to attend a meeting every Monday at 8 o'clock. Celia organizes meetings. The meetings take place in the auditorium. Celia organizes meetings in the auditorium. Okay, very good. So I will give you a few minutes to talk uh, about your activities at work in small groups, okay? Let's see, let's form. <laughs> yes, you are very focused in class. <laughs> Okay, join the groups and talk about your daily activities at work.
you are in your teacher. Thank you. Okay, okay, welcome back. Now it's time for the second attendance of the evening. So please be ready. Atilio Ernesto Castillo. Atilio Ernesto Castillo. Present, es que está lloviendo bien fuerte. Okay. Consuelo Saraí Rivas. Present. Consuelo, the personal session is with you tonight, okay? Okay. Erika de Nilsson Escobar. Present, teacher. Okay. Eric Jose Hernandez. Present, teacher. Good. Evelyn Guadalupe Gomez. Present. Yes, Hernan Antonio Chacón. Present teacher. Yes, Jennifer Gabriela Arevalo. Present. Okay, Jennifer Lisette Aquino. Present. Good, Jose Abel Izaguirre. Here present teacher. Okay, Jose Miguel Maza. Present. Okay. Juan Antonio Elias. Present. Good. Uh, Luis Miguel Corvera. Present. Okay. Marcos Vidal Umaña. Present. Perfect. Nelson Orlando Tejada. Nelson Orlando Tejada. Present. Okay. Pedro Alexander Osorto. Pedro Alexander Osorto. Present teacher. Ok. René Alessandro Teresón. Si no Here I am, teacher. Okay. Welcome. Ok. Okay. Ok. 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 Ruth Abigail Brito. Okay. Sofía Carolina Hernández. Sofía. William Alexander Paniagua. Present. Okay, Suleima Rosibel Catalán. Suleima. Jorge Luis Martínez. And Jose Fernando Marroquín. Present teacher. Okay. Okay. Okay, so tell me what you what um do you do at work? Okay, uh tell me what you do at work. Let me start with uh who one volunteer. Okay, Luis, go ahead. I I supervise this distributor. Yeah, I I try I train new employees. Mm -hmm. Um, sends reports every day. Okay, perfect. 
All right. Pass the question to someone else. Ask, ask another student, what do you do okay. at work? What do you do at work, René? <laughs> Welcome. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Thank you for your welcome. Well, I am in charge of collecting the money from the customer's bills. And also I deliver the bills from various areas where we have coverage. Yeah, and okay. only that though, if you wanna. Okay, perfect, that's enough. A okay. lot of work. Okay, Rene, ask someone else, what do you do at work? Uh, Okay, um, what do you do at work, Jennifer Arevalo? Um, I review my activity for a week and I check who of my passion has uh, control and weight. And I call my new passions and I review um, orders, or how do you say pedidos? Requests or orders, it's okay. Yes, orders. Okay, I review orders for my product, but I sell product um, reduction, natural reduction, and I supervise my therapies, uh, do a good um, treatment, treatment, treatment for in my clinic. Have um, I have machine for laser for um, how do you say quemar grasa? Burn. Burn. Okay, burn. Burn fat. Uh -huh. Burn for fat. I have many machines for burn fat and I supervise my therapy. It's good job for my passion. And she has um, relaxing uh, massages and reduction massages too. So I... Um, I nail um, all my therapy. It's um, a good job, but I see result in my passion. Wow. Basically. So, so. <laughs> you have a new client. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, good. Pass the question, Gabriela. Um, it's all. No, pass the question. Oh, another. pass the question. Mm, Jennifer Aquino. <laughs> okay. What do you do at work, Jennifer? I make ties. I write report accounting. I attend a meeting with box. I check document of the sale shopping. I uh, pay the supplier. Hmm. Supplier. Uh, play yes. the employer. Any place? Employees. Mm -hmm. Okay. Please. Employees. Okay. Very Employees. good. Very good. Pass the ball, Jennifer. Mm. What do you do work, Tony Elias? <laughs> the boss. I have I have many activities in the in the day, but the most important is um, check the progression of the sales um, for our distributors. Um, the deviation of sales is too important to make a uh, uh, activities to correct the, the, the good performance of the sales. Um, I organize very meetings with uh, different people 
like supervisors, uh, operations chief, and uh, owner of the distributors to um, make uh, corrections or activities to involve and grow up our sales. Okay, okay. Very good. Pass the ball, Tony. Okay, to William Alexander Paniawa. What do you do on your work? Okay. I design artwork for clients. I print digital files on Plotter and I keep track of the extensions of printing materials. Ah, okay. Thanks. Good, pass the question. Ah, okay. um, what do you do in your work, Marco Sumania? Okay. Um, I have a day report. I supervisor Charles Root in our Japan. Um, and I meeting in the Occident, Occidental Zone. Um, nada más. Okay. <laughs> Okay, good, very good. Pass the question. Atilio. Atilio. Tale the roots, Sonsonat. I trained the, the staff. I provide the information. I made the Excellent soul. Finish. Mm, okay, okay. Other question. Evelyn. Okay, go ahead, Evelyn. Ask me a question. <laughs> what is the question, Atilio? What do you do at work? What do you do at work? Okay, uh, I check product inventory on Monday. I prepare the invoices for my customers. And I send the reports to my customers. I pay employing. And I review the progress of the college. Bonita. Okay. What's the question? Hmm. What do you do at work? Uh, Marcos. Igual. Maña. Nuevamente. Pasala. ¿Ah? Pasala, ya la dijiste. No sé quién me ha pasado. Uh, ah. Bueno, yo ya que me ha pasado. Ok. Um, take inventories of off TV and cell phones every Monday. Um, clean a signet area. Uh, I wire report sellers um, visit client every Monday or the morning. Um, mm -hmm. Attendant, attendant clients. I'm finished. Okay. Okay. Good. Um, let's stop with that here. Uh, some words I want to clarify, clearly the pronunciation. 
uh, some of you said supervisor, but supervisor is the person. What does a supervisor do? Supervise. Supervises. Supervise. Okay. Salesman. That is the verb. Supervisor is the person. Supervise is the action a supervisor does. Yeah, a supervisor supervises uh, the production. The supervisor supervises the sales. Okay, the supervisor supervisors, then there is another word, employees. Employee, singular, employees, plural, employer is the boss. Yeah, the boss Tony, or the company. Okay, employer is the person who gives you the job or the company. My employer is Inglés Corporativo. That's my employer. Yes. Your employer is Claro for some of you. Yeah. Jose's employer is La Curacao. That's the employer. Employer. The workers are employees. Yeah. The people that work in the company are employees. employees. So make the difference between employee and employer. Uh, Occidental, it's, it's okay. It's very formal. It's more common to say the Western. You know, in English, the, 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 the cardinal points are east, so the, the east, the south, no, the east, the west, the south, and the north. Yeah? East, west, south, north. Okay? So... For example, here in El Salvador, San Miguel, La Unión, uh, Morazan are the eastern zone of the country. Are in the east. Yes? That is the east. El este, el oriente, east. Okay? The el occidente, el poniente is the west. Yeah, the west, the western, the western. Okay. Um, then the north, the north area is Chalatenango, basically, some parts of. Morazan, I think, Bañas, uh, something <laughs> like that. I don't know. And the central south. Central zone is correct. The south, yeah, the central zone, yeah. Okay. Occidental is, is, is a, it's correct. Yeah, it, it's very, very formal. It's, it's formal. Um, okay, basically, some things that I would like, I wanted to clarify in your speech. Okay, good. Now, uh, let's see, what else do we have here? Okay, let's move on to next lesson because we need to move on a little bit in the book. And then later I will give you some exercise to practice because in these conversations, in this lesson, 
we are talking about uh, everyday activities, routine, and that is what we call grammarly uh, the simple present. The simple present, okay? And I want to give you some information about that. But now let's take a look at this conversation. I'm going to record again this conversation in WhatsApp so you can practice it later if you want. You can listen to it, the pronunciation, etc. See, this is the, the group. Okay. Pay attention. What does Dominic do? Well, she is a secretary. Oh, I see. What does she do every day exactly? Oh, I see your point. Well, she types reports and sends emails every day. She is a hardworking woman. Absolutely. Does she arrive early? Yeah, she is the first person to arrive in the office. Okay, there it is. One more time. Listen. What does Dominique do? Well, she is a secretary. Oh, I see. What does she do every day exactly? Oh, I see your point. Well, she types reports and sends emails every day. She is a hardworking woman. Absolutely. Does she arrive early? Yeah, she is the first person to arrive in the office. Okay. Now let's practice. Repeat after me. What does Dominic do? What does, what does, does Dominic, Dominic do? do? What does Dominic do? Well, she is a secretary. Well, she, she is, a, is a, secretary. a secretary. Secretary. Oh, I see. What does she do every day exactly? Oh, I see. I see. What does she do every day exactly? Oh, I see your point. Well, she types reports and sends emails every day. She oh, is a hard-working oh, woman. Oh, oh, I see. Oh, I hear you. She types reports and sends emails every day. She is a hard-working woman. Hardworking. Absolutely. Does she arrive early? Absolutely. Yeah, she is the first person to arrive in the office. Yeah. Okay, very good. Very good. Now, I am Sonia and you are Matt. Okay? You are Matt. What does Dominic do? Well, 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 well he is a secretary. He is a secretary. Oh, I see. What does she do every day exactly? Oh, oh, I, I see you. Absolutely. Does she arrive early? Yes. Okay, very good. Any question with this conversation? Types, aquí lo tomo como sinónimo de escribir. Yes. Types. 
Yes. Como uh, digitar. O sea, type. type in the computer. You type in a typing machine. O sea, la máquina de escribir es una typing machine. That is the action. Mm -hmm. Y hardworking es una mujer trabajadora o alguien que le gusta trabajar mucho o fuerte. Yes, hard worker es alguien que es muy trabajador. Hard working, a hard working person es trabaja mucho. Hard working. Tony, hard working. All my people, too. <laughs> hard working person. Hard working is an adjective here. She is a hard working woman. So it's, it's, this is working as an adjective. Mm -hmm. Okay, very good. So um, let's see. I want you to practice the conversation and then work in this exercise. You have to choose one of the two words in every sentence, okay? What is the correct form for the sentence? So I'll put you in pairs and I want you to practice the conversation several times and then complete this exercise. Exercise three. All right, so let me form the couple. Uh -oh. Okay. Okay, join your groups, practice the conversation, and complete exercise three. See you in 10 minutes.
Okay, welcome back. Okay, let's check this before. Number one, is she type or she types? Types. 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 Okay. She types reports. She types. Number two, do or does? Does. 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 The correct economy does. Number three, does she arrive or arrives early? Arrive. 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 Okay, very good, very good, very good. So here we have some information about the, the simple present. Let me show you to add some extra information to. As you remember, <clears throat> the simple present in affirmative sentences, <clears throat> the verb doesn't change, except with third person singular, he, she, it. With third person singular, we have as, ES or IES to the verbs. I will also show you a chart um, for that. So we use the verb in the basic form um, for I, you, we, you, and they. And we only change the verb or he, she, and he, it. She, it. Then the negative form, we form the negative form with do not or don't. Okay. We use don't for I, you, we, you, they. And doesn't for he, she, it. He, it. So we say, I don't go, you don't go, he, he doesn't does go, go, she doesn't he go, doesn't go, he doesn't go. Doesn't go. Doesn't go. Doesn't then we don't go, you don't go, they don't go. And for questions, we use the auxiliary do at the beginning of the questions. Or just no questions, basically. Yeah, use do for I, you, we, you, they, and does for he, she, it. Uh, just a review, okay, about this. This is the, the simple present form. Okay. Then, um, I also want to share this other chart with you. Okay. This is the chart for the third person singular. The rules for the third person singular, he, she, it. So most of the verbs, la mayoría de los verbos, we only add S. When we 
conjugate the verb with he, she, it. In general, most of the verbs we only add s. So work becomes works, it becomes its, play, plays, swim, swims, write, writes. But when the verb ends in consonant plus y, we drop the y, we remove the y and write i a e s i e s. So study becomes studies. But remember that the condition is that must be consonant and y at the end of the verb. You see, consonant and y. Consonant and mm, consonant and Y. Yeah. See? Because the for example, the verb play. In third person is plays. Yeah. Because it doesn't fit the condition. The con is not consonant. A is not consonant. Yeah. So if the if the verb ends in vowel and why? We only have S. Yeah. Vowels. Remember the vowels are A, E, I, O, U. Those are the vowels. If the verb ends in A and vowel and Y, we say we only have S. But if the verb ends in consonant and Y, we change for I, E, S. And finally, when the verb ends in O, S, H, T, e, C, H, X, or double S, we have E, S. For example, go becomes goes. Wash, washes. Watch, watches. Mix, mixes. Is, pieces. Okay? So these are the rules for third person singing. Any question with this? I see that Tony put the screenshot already. Thank you. You saved me some time. Is this clear, people? It's just a reminder, yeah, because I I think you studied this module one. And um then I will give you some exercise to practice. I will give you this exercise to practice basically the third person singular. Well, well everything is here, not only third person singular. Okay, okay I will put this activity in WhatsApp. Mm. Look at this chart. Uh, 
Okay, this exercise, you have to complete the sentences with the correct form of the verb. Okay, so I will give you time to work on this. We only have 10 minutes to finish the class. Well, that's a good time to complete the sentences. You can write the sentences in your notebook if you want, or the, just the answer. Okay, complete the sentences, please, with the correct form of the verb. Let me see.
finish teacher. Okay, I will take the last attendance while you are working, okay? Atilio Ernesto Castillo. Present. Okay. Consuelo Saray Rivas. Present teacher. Okay, please don't go. Erika Denilson Escobar. Present teacher. Good. Eric Jose Hernandez. Present teacher. Good. Evelyn Guadalupe. Present. Hernan Antonio Chacón. Present teacher. Okay. Jennifer Gabriela Arevalo. Present. Okay. Jennifer Lisset Aquino. Present. Good. Jose Abel Izaguirre. Here present teacher. Good. Jose Miguel Maza. Present. Okay. Juan Antonio Elias. Present teacher. Good. Luis Miguel Corvera. Pre present. Okay. Marcos Vidal Umaña. Present. Okay. Nelson Orlando Tejada. Present. Ok, Pedro Alexander Osorto. Present. Yes, René Alessandro Teresón. Here I am, teacher. Good. Ruth Abigail Brito. Present. Ok. Sofía Carmen Hernández. Sofía Carolina Hernández. William Alexander Paniagua. Present. Okay. Sulaima Rosibel Catalán. Jorge Luis Martínez. And Jose Fernando Marroquín. Present teacher. Okay, people. It's time. It's time to go. Okay. We are going to check these exercises tomorrow. So and finish, do it, and we'll check it tomorrow. Bye. Have a good night, good people, night. and see you tomorrow. Take care. Good night. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye. Bye. Good evening, guys. Bye. 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 Okay, Consuelo, how are you? Ay, bye. Este, hoy siento que cuesta más, teacher. Habla mucho inglés. Me quedo perdida hay veces. Y ellos pueden mucho.
No como los primeros, ellos pueden bastante. No todos, hay algunos que sí. Yo, no, pero ah, ellos hablan mucho en inglés y me, yo me quedo perdido. ¿Qué dicen? Digo yo. <risa> Hasta me da pena participar. Ya. Ah, poco a poco, poco a poco, pero me vamos a nivelar un poco también. Sí, hay unos aquí no. que deberían estar quizá en otros niveles. Pero no, sí. igual, igual pueden servirnos de apoyo, hay que apoyarnos en ellos. Sí, bien avanzados, todos hablan en inglés yo me quedo, y más que hacen las cosas rapidito yo voy despacito pues. <risa> en la Pero, tarea lo que quiere sí. ¿Sí? en Dime. la tarea lo que quiere profe, es que pongamos los, es las que dicen tú con el verbo pero están desordenadas va eh, bueno el, el verbo está justo para cada oración vamos a poder compartir la oración tiene a la par el verbo que hay que ponerle, ese es el que tienes que utilizar mm, y no hay que cambiar yo dándome duro pensé que, que tenía que poner uno de todos los demás que estaban desordenados no, desordenados no están, pero en la forma correcta, porque si es por ejemplo acá, Charlie ¿verdad? el verbo es to tidy pero ¿cómo se escribe este verbo en tercera persona? Porque Charlie es él. Ah. ¿Ya? Ajá, el pues no lo había entendido. O sea, hay que poner el verbo en la forma correcta, como es este, pero en la forma correcta. Por ejemplo, acá tendría que ser Charlie sometimes tidies. Mm, tidies. Ay, que saber, algo nunca lo había oído, por eso dice que decir, lo fue a buscar. Me salía bien confuso. Solo ah. eso es lo que tengo que hacer, poner el verbo de la forma correcta, si es tercera o oh, eso Exacto. lo es. Sí. Ah. Eso es todo. Y sí, yo ahí bien confundida. <ríe> Gracias. Ahí vamos a ir combinando Spanish también, pero poquito. Voy a ir para tener, aprender más vocabulario. ¿Cómo hago? Apre veo video. Para que así no me dejen perdida. Eh, Te compartió la página donde hay varios videos, donde se pueden ver videos, el módulo pasado. No, 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 no me lo compartió. Ah. Ah, entonces, te lo voy a escribir ahí en el chat. Vale. Y te la voy a enseñar. Bye. ¿Cuál es? ¿Y cómo se puede? ¿Cómo la puedes usar? Es esta. Esta es... Bueno, como dice aquí, una, una librería de videos. ¿Verdad? Están organizados, como puedes ver acá, por niveles. Uno, Pero no dos. me cambió la página. No te cambió. Ah. La misma estoy viendo la de los muñequitos. Ahorita. Va. Ahora sí. Mm. Los videos están acá organizados por niveles, ¿verdad? Niveles hasta avanzado. Entonces, digamos, entras acá, nivel 1. Y aquí hay varios videos. Lo bueno que son videos cortos, no son videos largos, no son, no son, eh, no son clases tampoco. Sino que son conversaciones, entrevistas con gente real. Por ejemplo, mira este. De dos personas hablan acerca de la ropa y su reloj. Y acá está el video. Mira, tres minutos. Cuenta. Acá está el texto. 
-huh. el video, puedes escuchar, leer, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. Hay un pequeño archivo de gramática, de la gramática que se utiliza en el video, ¿verdad? Una pequeña lección. Y un quiz, un examencito de, de comprensión, ¿verdad? Para que, que tanto entendiste del video. Uh -huh. Y este eh, me tengo que meter a un link o a una página. Ay, ay, ay. A, ese, a, ese enla a esa página que te puse ahí en el chat. Se llama Elo, Elo con tres L's. A ver. Esta, ¿verdad? Eh. Y me lo puso en el chat de aquí del... ¿Del el, el Zoom? Entonces, espérame, que no lo he visto. Sí, ahorita lo voy a ver. Para copiarlo. Solo me lo pongo y me meto ahí. Ah, Elo. Elo con tres L's. Vaya, te lo voy a anotar. Elo.org. Y solo pones eso ahí y ya te abre. Vaya. Sí, porque ya me había desanimado, sí. Ay, no, dije yo, hasta me daba tiempo. Hasta me daba cuando entraba a la clase. Sí, estoy conociendo, lo estoy sondeando, pero no todos, no todos. Hay varios. Son, son pocos, son como unos cuatro. Sí, pero sí pueden bastante. Sí, sí. No sé si igual hay que aprovecharlos, o sea. Cuando tenga sí. grupos, aprovecha y... Sí, ya, Tony, pues, mi, él, él me, me, me corrige la pronunciación. Uh -huh. ¿Verdad? Y esta página te puedes... Va, está bien. ¿Ya? Sí. Eh, otra cosa que yo no sé si te recomendé la... la la música tipo Bossa Nova. No. ¿Cuál es esa? Aquí lo voy a anotar. Mira. Voy a mostrar aquí en YouTube. Vos te vas a YouTube. Y le pones. Bossa Nova. Bossa Nova. Covers. Covers porque son canciones. Te van a aparecer listas y videos con canciones con por ejemplo mira este mira este que está acá este mix de youtube son canciones populares conocidas algunas pero lo bueno es que el ritmo no lo pongo porque con derechos nos puede fregar esto está bien verdad eh, son canciones populares pero a ritmo lento mm. entonces se entiende es más fácil entenderlo ¿Ya? y a medida que uno va entendiendo pues va va mejorando mm. su vocabulario va está bien no, no, eso es otra cosa que te puedes para ir enriqueciendo ahí el vocabulario, ir mejorando el oído, ¿verdad? Y por lo tanto, pues también la Va a estar ¿Ya? bien. Y no, no te desanimes y lo bueno es de estar con gente que sabe más que uno es que tenemos para aprender. <risa> ok. Bye. Estaremos Muchas viendo gracias, entonces. Bye, hasta okay. mañana, pasa bonita noche. Ok, Adiós. good night, bye bye. Good night.